Hello guys, welcome to Life at Germany with me, Vinu. In today's video, I'm going to talk about blue card in Germany. For those who don't know about what is blue card, it is similar to a visa through which you can enter into Germany. So let's see what are the requirements in order to apply for this blue card visa. The first requirement in order to apply for this uh, blue card is either you should have a German degree or any foreign degree which is comparable with the German degree. This is the first requirement. Second requirement is uh, in order to apply for blue card, you should have a job offer letter from a German company. So. In Germany, usually they call it as a work contract. So you should have a valid work contract from a German company in order to apply for this blue card visa. Your job contract can either be a fixed term contract or unlimited contract. If it is fixed term contract, at least it should be six months. Only then you are eligible to apply for blue card. The next thing is with respect to salary. In order to apply for blue card, your gross salary per annum should be 45,300 euros. So only if you are meeting this criteria, then only you can apply for blue card. For some profession which is called as bottleneck profession, for those profession this salary level is again decreased to some extent. It means your salary should be 41,041.80 cents. So if your salary is at least 41,000 euro, 41.80 cents, in that case, you can apply for blue card visa but this salary expectation is only for certain profession which is called as bottleneck profession let's see what are those professions coming under bottleneck profession for example uh, manufacturing mining distribution managers uh, those category will come under this bottleneck profession and also information and communication technology managers, professional service managers, uh, including health uh, care, uh, health services and care services. So profession belongs to STEM profession. Those also come under this bottleneck profession category. Doctors, pharmacies, uh, veterinarians, uh, etc. So like this, uh, these professions are coming under bottleneck professions. And if you got job under this profession, then your salary limit should be 41,041 euro. Also, there is a special case. If you have uh, completed your graduation, which is less than three years, then also if you have a job contract and your, your gross salary limitation is 41,000 euro and 4180 cents. So this is the limitation also for entry level professions so there is consideration for it professionals uh, who is having three to seven years of experience in that case uh, their gross salary can also be at least 41,000 euros 41,000 41 euros 80 cents so in that case also you are eligible to apply for blue card <music> So what is the validity for this blue card? Usually when you apply for the blue card, what will be the validity given for this blue card? So your blue card validity always depends on your employment contract validity. For example, if your employment contract is fixed term of one year, then you will get a blue card of one year and additional three months will be given for the blue card. So the maximum validity for a blue card is four years. So you will get a blue card up to four years. It's also a possibility to extend uh, this blue card after four years. Again, it depends on the job contract which you are getting after this completing this four years. In case 
within one year you are going to change your job and you already have a blue card in that case it is mandatory that you need to inform the foreign authority i mean uh, uh, inform the visa office and then depending on that either your uh, blue card will be changed to residence permit or uh, whatever uh, visa is uh, needed it will be changed accordingly but within one year if you are changing your job with blue card then you need to inform the foreign authorities and what are the benefits of having this blue card if you are having the blue card and with blue card if you completed 21 months and you also have a german level b1 certificate in that case you are eligible to apply for permanent resident permit it means pr and also if you have a blue card and you completed 33 months and you have a valid a1 german level certificate in that case also you are eligible to apply for permanent resident so these are the benefits which you have when you already have a blue card you already got a job contract then why are you waiting for check your eligibility based on your degree level and the job contract and also the gross salary and then you can go and apply for the blue card visa for those who are not aware what is blue card visa then i think uh, this video is will be useful for you so please check this video and if you are having eligible work contract and the the salary limitation which i mentioned in the video then yes for sure you can go and apply for blue card visa hope this video is useful for you let's see you in the next video until then bye from you know bye